Hey folks, this is Anders and welcome to this video about the infamous Lost Bugatti. Please watch. The Secrets of the Lost Bugatti Atlantic As you all know, Bugatti is one of the most luxurious brands in the car industry. They are highly respected around the world for their historic and fantastic cars. This is the world of Bugatti where dreams are built in form of machine, where precision meets passion, and where every moment behind the wheel is a masterpiece of engineering. Bugatti isn't just about cars, it's a relentless pursuit of excellence. Each Bugatti is a work of art, sculpted by the hands of skilled workers and fueled by endless pursuit of perfection. And perhaps one of the most artistic Bugattis is the Bugatti Type 57 SC Atlantic. The car was designed by Jean Bugatti, the son of Itor Bugatti, the founder of Bugatti. It features a sleek and aerodynamic inspired design, and yet only four were ever built. The body of the car is made of lightweight hand-beaten aluminum which contributes to its unique appearance. Under the hood, the Atlantic is powered by a 3.3-liter inline 8-cylinder engine. This was a significant amount of power during its time, making it a really fast car. The Bugatti 57 Atlantic is known for its extreme rarity. As mentioned, only four were ever built, and today only three are known to exist. The fourth Atlantic, often referred to as the Lost Bugatti Atlantic, disappeared during World War II and has never been found. I'm sorry, but could you consider to subscribe? Thanks a lot, and let's continue. The whereabouts of the fourth Bugatti Atlantic have been the subject of much debate and speculation. It was previously owned by Jean Bugatti before World War II and it disappeared during the conflict. There are various theories about what happened to it, but it has never been recovered, making it one of the most famous lost cars in the world. But it's still fun to speculate as of where its whereabouts at. Many believe it was destroyed dur during the war. Given the chaos and devastation of the time, it's possible that the car was damaged, lost or intentionally destroyed to prevent it from falling into enemy hands. This theory is of course entirely possible, but it's still not as fun as some of the other theories. Another and much more fun theory is that the car might be hidden in plain sight, perhaps stored away in a secret collection or owned by a private individual who keeps it out of the public eye. This theory speculates that the car could resurface at some point, possibly after decades of being concealed. But the theory I think we all might be the most interested in is that to this day it's still stored away and forgotten in some old barn, just waiting there to be discovered by some lucky individual. Just imagine opening that old barn near your house to see the iconic silhouette of the Bugatti in the corner underneath an old rag. I get chills down my back just thinking about it. We can all hope, but this is still all speculation and dreaming. Maybe we will one day see that very silhouette, but till that day comes. Thanks for watching. I would appreciate if you could subscribe and leave your thoughts in the comments below.